new Trendo 2 again here. And and if you remember what I said earl earlier today, like in the morning, then you probably heard me say, hear me say that later on the day I am gonna talk about more the, the plush movie called Mario and the Guardians of Defense. Well, here we are. Well, here we are talking about it right now. So, Mario and the Guardians of Defense. It's a movie. It's another one. It's another movie I want to make. And it is a Mario fan fiction plush movie. A confirmed Mario. A confirmed Mario fan fiction plush movie. And I might I, I might not even bother staying here talking about it for an hour. Which is very unusual because I usually I wouldn't talk about things for an hour. But I might wait here I am. Because we might talk about it a little outside. Because I am thinking about the possibility of making a, plus, a normal plush video today. A normal plush video today. Having you, having you over that truck. But that's just a possibility. That doesn't mean that doesn't mean I'm actually going to make a plush feed video today. It, it's just a possibility, and and since I'm making this plus this this normal video, I don't know why I said that, but I'm talking about it, talking about a plush movie. Let's go outside. Into the woods, talk about it a little bit. Well, of course, this is going to take a while. <laughs> because I am going to talk about it with my fellow plushies around. <laughs> of course, this is going to take a really long time. <laughs> this is a walk back and forth. But, but I will, but I will skip those parts when I walk back and forth, back and forth. And someday I have to clean these woods up. Because they're gonna become. Because if I don't, then they'll become a huge mess. And it's already. And I know it's already a mess. <laughs> I'm gonna go get the other ones. Oh, look at there. Even though we're not talking about Sonic Origins Splash movie, that's some of the stuff. That's some of the material. That's some of the material that was involved with it. I'm not gonna tell you what it was. I'm not gonna really tell you. I'm not gonna tell you really what which, which scene that was in because because that's for you guys to figure out when you watch it. But I'm but I'm not telling you. But I'm not telling you because I'm not gonna give the story away until it comes because. Yeah, because you are the ones that have to watch the story, pay attention, and know what the story is. Okay. Well, we're getting. Well, we're getting there. We're getting there now. We're getting there now. A dozen more to go. Actually, just kidding. 
There's three more to go. Wait a minute. Where is there three? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot about Buka. But I'm not going to tell you what type of person he is because his person, like, since it's fan fiction, his personality could be different. But I'm not going to tell you what his personality is or what and all the information you know about him because that is for you to figure out. You, that's for you, the viewer, to find out when you, when the story comes out. I'm gonna have to pause this for a couple seconds. See you right there in the woods. I'm trying my best not the, not. The... Okay. So we actually got four more to go. <clears throat> now I'm gonna skip this part. There's stuff going all over me. Now while we walk over there, we can talk about what you uh, about. Can't talk about what what could be expected for Sonic. We could speak in Sonic Origins Plus, maybe like what's expected for Super Sonic and Sonic. Of course, their powers they'll be using is speed and their whatever. But if you're expecting those powers from the original Sonic the Hedgehog Plus movie, then no, those powers are not going to be there because. Because this, because that, because this is the origin story, you see. So this actually starts way before Sonic ever ended up in the Mario universe. So no wonder. But he can read attacks. But that's all I'm gonna be able to but that's all I'm gonna be able to share. Now back to now back to Mario and the Guardians of Defense. I have to try to crack Harry Four, which is gonna be a struggle. Without dropping him. I have to grab him somewhere. Okay. Now, like I said, we, may, we are probably going to be talking about this for an hour. And trust me, you guys can do it. You can stick around for an hour. Because, because I'm probably going to be talking about like so much of what's going to be expected. Like, like your music and stuff, everything. And I will be walking around with my plushies as I talk about it. So, starting with the main thing, but we're gonna, but, but, but I know we usually start with story, but. But since but since I'm not allowed to give that away, we're gonna we're gonna skip we're gonna skip the story. It go on to the filter. So the filter is a big deal when it comes to when it when it comes to plush movies like this. When it comes to big plush movies like that like this, because this is a big plush movie, you see. And big plush movies deserve a lot of work put into them, you see. And first of all, and oh, yeah. So basically, the lighting and lighting and the lighting. If you, if you know lighting, you have to know lighting and the sh and the shade and everything. 
But, yep, it shows in half I use for that. For every bit of that, even the lighting. I use, and you have to, and you also have to make sure, yeah, but the, but, but the lighting is not the only thing, okay, guys? Like, let's be honest with each other. Lighting is always important, but, but brightness is also another important thing. It's similar, it sounds, it sounds like as if it were lighting. But 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 you don't want but you but with filters you don't want a filter to be too bright. You don't want a filter to be too bright. You see. And the reason I'm telling you this is because because I'm gonna be work because because I am gonna be working on it for for a long time. Like this plush movie is a big deal. Now theming and everything. The theming is basically what the theming is basically gonna it's gonna be the music it's gonna well theming for example on this channel the music is gonna tell the entire story with theming. Or you can think about the tie or you can, or you could try it the hard way, like, like determine what the, like determine what this is actually gonna be, like determine what theme Mario and the Guardians events could possibly be, like could it possibly be Mario and Guardian, Mario and Guardians teaming up to defeat a villain or something. Could it be that? Or could it be Mario and the Guardians teaming up to find gold to get to get to get rich or something? Or could it be re or could it be related to like like to a Marvel thing or something? Like 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 a, like a heaven thing, or a Marvel thing. Like we got these guardians, like Guardians of the Galaxy, for example. I think that's a pretty good. I think that's a pretty good movie, and it has a great theme. So, anyways, with themes, now with music. Music. We're gonna talk, so with music, we're gonna talk about music a lot. And with fan fiction. So, music. The music we use on this channel will be typically described But you might the music to like fit this flush movie. And that's what I want it to fit. I want the music, I want the music to fit this plush movie. And that's what I've been working on. I've been working to make it fit the plush movie. Like I don't want it to be like a boring like I don't want it to be like a boring plush movie. Like what would a plush movie like like seriously? Who would want a plush movie with no music? Absolutely nobody. Because, let's just face it. Plush movies with no music suck. And the, Mar and the new Super Mario plush movie is a plain example, but actually, no it's not, because it's okay. Doesn't use a lot of music, but, it'll, but, it, but it has music there, there and now. In the plush movie. And the theme I'm going for is Super Mario Galaxy and and lots of other game music. And 
and this is not being used as like your own music this is being used like in a, in a plush movie and using using the music that way is all right but the way you don't want to use it but the what the way you don't use it is make your own music out of it make your own songs out of it because don't because you can't do that because because Nintendo owns those songs, okay? They they own that music. They own their music. The Galaxy music belongs to Nintendo. But you but you can use it for plush movies. You can't but you cannot I mean you cannot make your own song out of it. Because it belongs to Nintendo. I know that sounds pretty selfish, but 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 that's copyright infringement. But the way I use it, compared to others, is way different. Because I use it for my plush movies, and I and I do it because I don't want the like the fans to get bored in the plush during the plush movies because I want it because music can easily gain a lot of attention in a plush movie it can gain some and if I, and if I have to go even and if I have to go even more out of my way with music I can even do, I can even, I can even uh, put some songs in my plush movie from Mario Odyssey. Like that, like those songs for example. I know we're all excited to see what type of music it has, but it's gonna be but it's gonna be a while because I mean I'm, I mean it may not be a couple months. It, it, it depends when I'm working on it because there will be times when I work on it, like like yeah maybe tonight I might try working on it. Okay. Oh. Hold on here a couple minutes. For a couple seconds, actually. Now, if you're going to ask, then yes, Toad is going to be in the plush movie. So yeah, music, it's going to take a while, and I'm going to put my best work into the music. Yeah.
and maybe this won't last an hour. We, we can see how uh, we can see how far we get with this thing. We may not get into an hour, but yeah, it's devastatingly hard to give the store to not give the story away. But I'm not. But I'm. But at the same time, if I gave you the story away. Did it, and then, then it wouldn't be a surprise anymore to see it, because you would already know what what is going to happen. That's why I can't. So I'm trying to keep it a surprise. For my own good. Now the rise and fall of it. Now the rise and fall. Now I'm not gonna well now I'm not gonna tell you the rise and fall of the film either. Because because that would basically be giving half of the story away and I don't wanna do that. So yeah. But I can tell you. But I can tell you examples of, of the rise and fall. The rise and fall is like the problem that the characters deal with. So Mario and the others are going to be dealing with some problem. But they're not going to be dealing with one problem, with one rise and fall. They're not gonna, but there's not gonna be one rise and fall. There's gonna be like multiple rises and falls. But I can't tell you what what any of them are because that because because again I am prohibited to do to do that. Me now not allowed to do that. Because I'm trying to keep it a secret until it comes out. And the ending. The ending I can't tell you either, but it's going to tell you. It's gonna be. It's gonna, the ending may be shocking, but I'm not gonna tell you why. I'm not gonna. But I'm not gonna tell you the end. I'm not gonna tell you why. The ending may be shocking because. I know I'm wanting to say it, but I can't. Because... Because the bad... Because it starts out... Because the ending, start, the ending starts out as a bad ending. It turns into a good... Starts out... It's kind of like a half, half good ending, half bad ending thing. Yeah, but I think we're just gonna go for a half hour here.
plan. I may come back and make a plush video today. There's a good chance. Let's go back in the garage. Here in a couple minutes. Now guys, here in a couple minutes. Actually in a couple seconds possibly. I'm about to let Mario take over. It's going to be like I'm not even there. I guess not, though. So Mario is not going to be able to take over on the camera right now. But if he could, he would have a lot to say. And yes, this is the new, 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 new Trendo channel. New, new Trendo channel, Mario. And, it, yep, and if you prefer calling New Trendo 2 just New Trendo, then that's fine. You can call it New Trendo. That's what I prefer calling it. But I prefer calling it New Trendo 2. Because if I don't, then I might get mixed up on what Nutrendo channel I'm talking about. Like if I mention Nutrendo, and I'll be like, wait, 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 wait. What, which Nutrendo channel am I talking about? One or two? Oh uh, well, of course, the second channel. Yep. So I have to say Nutrendo two, or else I might get lost. I might have to end this video early. Okay.